Uh, tomorrow's harvest date on our meat birds. We got 18 in that pen. I got 18 in this pen. We're gonna harvest these 18 tomorrow. Uh, we've had them for eight weeks. Today, they're gonna be put in the freezer. Those will too. They got another week to go. Yeah, it's gonna be a little shot of our setup for killing chickens and harvesting our meat birds. Uh, killing cone, that's where we cut their neck. Scalding pot, warming pot, automatic chicken plucker, eviscerating station. This is our killing cone station. This is where we cut their neck. Let them bleed out in the bucket. We usually do one at a time, but I figure we're gonna have some help tomorrow. We'll bump it up to maybe two speed process. All right, this is a scalding pot and a warming pot. As you scald a chicken in this one, the water eventually evaporate down a little, a good bit actually. So we keep some warm. That way when you put it in there, you ain't gotta heat it all back up. And it's just water. There ain't a whole lot of secret and science to it. And the cones, that are just to keep folks from walking through here. That's a, that's a hazard with the gas lines running through there. And we don't want people tripping, so we just put the cones up. Because we can. Believe it or not, that's the star of the show. Automatic chicken plucker. That makes life so easy. Once they're scalded, the birds, you put them in there, you turn it on, and this thing goes wee real fast, and it plucks your bird for you. Here. Got a switch for the water. And a switch for the machine. And you go whoo, in about 30 seconds, you got a naked bird. And of course you got an ice chest to put the birds in when they're out of the plucker. Until this guy can get to This is our eviscerating station. This is where we clean our, our dress our birds. Skin them, gut them, keep all the innards we want to keep. I usually keep a bucket or two for liver and hearts and gizzards, and I'll just, you know, dump them over. That's a uh, water and spigot. That way you keep you a little bit of running water with you gutting. Fill the cavity up and rinse it out. And we got an ice chest uh, to put the birds in when we're done before we bag them and tag them. 